Now to today's big story, the Somerset community mourning the death of 26-year-old Ben Garza tonight. He was killed today while working with a trash compactor in West Bear County. How it happened, investigators are still trying to figure out. The night team's Courtney Friedman spoke with Garza's loved ones who say he was a big part of the community. He was uh, one of the only guys to wear face paint in the event, and he went by Wicked J. Um, he, he liked the Joker, you know, the comic book character. Ben Garza was known far beyond Somerset, the small town he grew up in. His in-character wrestling was wildly popular online, and he was also in a breakdancing crew. I have known Ben for a very, very long time. We met in karate class when I was about 10 years old. And ever since then, we were like brothers. Alex Garza started a whole wrestling organization with Ben in Somerset called Extreme Showdown Wrestling. And me and Ben actually uh, were brothers backstage, but in the ring, we're actually, we're always against each other. Uh, but it, it was a, an honor. I actually wrestled him on Saturday, which is extra emotional for me because I shared his last moment in the ring. Ben was a garbage collector for Metro Waste Systems, and at 10.15 this morning, he died in a tragic trash compact accident. Bear County Sheriff's investigators are still trying to figure out how it happened. And the fact that he's gone is, is still kind of surreal to all of us. Alex says Ben was the life of the party, a genuine person who everyone loved. Naturally gifted at anything he did. Anything he did, he was just a true entertainer. He loved to make people smile, loved to make people laugh. Whether through his wrestling, dancing, or his loyal friendship, his life has made a lasting impact. Hey, Buster, baby! Courtney Friedman, KSAT 12 News. It was clear after talking to those that we did today that there was a big outpouring of love and support for Ben Garza online and also in Somerset. There was a candlelight vigil planned at a city park tonight as a way for those who loved Ben Garza to say goodbye.